Hey guys, welcome back. Um, just recently, I, before the van was coming up, I ordered uh, four Boss stabilizing legs. Now these legs are a lot more sturdier than the ones that come with the van. There's nothing wrong with the ones that come with the van, but I'm leaning more towards using the Boss gear. I have a Boss jockey wheel, I have a Boss mover to move my caravan, and now I've got the Boss legs. Each leg can hold 1800 kilo. So therefore, what you can actually do is use the legs to jack the whole van up if you need to change your wheels. That way, you don't need to use a jack. So you're cutting down on your weight by not carting a jack, but also the legs are a lot easier to use. Okay, when they come, they come with, uh, obviously you can buy two, you can buy three, you can buy four, buy as many as you want. Um, they come with one in a box. So we've got a box here, so this is what they come like. Open the box up, and in the box, this is your leg. It also comes with a little pin and a bigger foot. You put it in, put the pin through. They also send you a little extension. So you can actually raise it up fairly high. Very easy to use and very easy to install. One here, it even gives you the directions. It tells you, you can put the legs out on an angle to stabilize a van, but don't actually try to make it hold weight. You need it straight down to be able to hold the uh, weight of the van. Also on here, it tells you that the load limit is 1800 kilo per leg, and they've been limit tested. All right, there's an actual phone number on here to boss. Uh, boss are out of Sydney. I'll send the stuff in the mail and uh, putting together is quite simple. All right, put the leg together. Open up the uh, leg here. All right, got a little clip with the actual thing. Make sure that you've got the riding up the right way. Go straight into here. You can see that there's a little hole just on here. Comes with a little uh, clip. Just poke the clip through. There it is. Now, when you're using the leg, you can either pull or push. Either way, don't try pulling it from the centre. And if you have a look down in here, as you pull and push, it releases so that you can move it to whatever angle you need it. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna do after assembling the leg, I'm gonna remove the leg that was on the van off of the van. I suppose a good thing about these too is you don't have to put those little, you know those little yellow plates we carry to put under the feet because you've got such a big flat surface, surface on it. You don't need those little yellow stabiliser things that we put actually under those feet so we don't get stuck in the sand. Okay, that one's off. That one's off, pull out that pin. That pin. Okay, so that's one leg taken off. And as Ros was just explaining, the difference in surface cover this is the boss one, and this is the one that comes stock standard. Grab the new leg. One pin in. Okay, now we 
do the bolts up. I'll grab the pin came with it, grab the leg. Okay, and if we want to put it up, just pull this out, releases it. Up she goes. You can also come down in that position, it's actually locked in. You can extend the leg or back down at 90 degrees. Around the side here, it actually comes with a little uh, thing that plugs into your drill. Go straight into this little hole here with your drill. Zzz, down comes the leg, or zzz, up goes the leg. How's it going? Simple as. All right, so that was it. Probably 10 minutes per leg. So if you've got the right tools and you're quick enough, 30 minutes, change all your legs. In the van is going to be a lot better off for it. And you can do it from either side? So, like to yeah, you can pull it that way, or you can pull it that way. Okay. Or push. It actually tells you on the front, push, pull. Right, it just stays like that. Oh, it's locked in. Mm. Now, each leg... comes with some extenders so if you're on a lot higher ground it also comes with a little part for your drill bit all right that part if you come down here Ros also fits the boss jockey wheel again it comes with uh, extra pieces to make it longer at the bottom depending on where you are, or you can make it shorter. Also, it comes with a couple of ribs on the side. You can move it up and down in the bracket to whatever height you want it to be at. One piece does all four legs. If you walk around, you'll see all the four legs on the van. And uh, now that I've got them on, I'm actually going to uh, take the yellow stickers off and jack the van up. Now with most drills, they'll have the screw and they'll have the hammer. Never use the hammer on these or it can shatter the inside parts of the actual legs and the actual jockey wheel. So make sure it's on the screw. It's going up, we want to go down. Go to the front one. They're very easy, very simple. One drill, the one uh, tool bit, do all your stuff at the one time. Walk around and you can level your van out. If you need it higher on one side and you don't have airbags, how simple a way to do it than using these boss legs. If you do have airbags, you still use them. They're gonna hold the van fairly well. If you need to change your tires or rotate your tires, instead of putting a jack under there and mucking around, do your four legs and away you go. Okay, so that is Boss Jockey Wheel and the Boss uh, Stabilizer uh, stabilizer Legs. Alright, they have a few other things. Jump on their website, have a look. Roz will put the uh, website information, contact details down there. Um, great guy, Jürgen. Um, great guy to deal with. 
and his uh, staff down there. Uh, if you like the videos, please uh, like, hit the like button, hit the notification and subscribe, and I'll keep more coming. All right, one quick, simple little fix to help your van and give you a better life caravanning. See you later, guys. Before we go, remember, joke time with Dave. Actually, it's not a joke. Hey, hey Roz. Yes, Dave. I was talking to my mate the other day, and he was just saying to me that he uh, failed his Aboriginal music test. I said, did you redo it? Catches. <laughs>